Orange County, this woman accused of murdering her own sister because that woman had a and her long distance boyfriend had been flirting apparently. Twenty one year old Fatima Marzan is accused of stabbing her twenty year old sister three to four times. Deputies say Marzan recently found out that her sister would flirt with the boyfriend while playing video games, so she bought a set of knives two weeks ago with plans to kill her sister. Marzan is now in jail with no bond. Yo, YouTube, YouTube, what's going on? Trey back again to you all with another video. Hope y'all are having a very great day. Hope y'all are having a very great week also. My day is going absolutely stupendous. And big shout out to all the channel members, all subscribers of the Trey King Show family. And much love to each and every last one of you all. Now, you all, before I dive deep into this story, I get asked a lot of questions. Yes, I do. Some of you all read the comments. I get asked, Trey, how do your skin and why do your skin look so beautiful, so supple, so Fool, so bountiful. They be asking all kinds of questions. Well, today I want to answer that question right there for those who want to know why my skin looks so beautiful all the time. Uh, I need you all to come closer right now because it's a big secret. Now, come on. It's called washing your, look at the bottom. That's all you have to do, just wash it. Anyway, now back to the story. Now, before I start the story, I want to thank the channel members and also the subscribers of the Trey King Show for sending me this story because it's very sad and disheartening what happened to, yes, Miss Saber Marzan. And also, this goes to show you what some people say, keep it in the family. No, you should never keep it in the family. Now, this story right here comes out of Florida by way of Orlando. And big shout out to everybody in the great state of Florida. Everybody in the great city of Orlando in Florida. Yes, we know you all had a bad hurricane come through there. So we're keeping you all in our prayers. But guess what? If it ain't one thing, it's a mother. No, you feel what I'm saying? Now, anyway, now this story right here comes as no shock because some people just can't take rejection. But I'm going to tell you like this. If somebody don't want you, what you should do is let them go. Now, you have a 21-year-old Father Ha Marzan. Yes, that's her name. Father Ha Marzan. Say it with me, everybody. Father Ha Marzan. Y'all still messed up. Damn. Anyway, the father ha, Marzan is accused, well not accused, she admitted it already. She's arrested for killing her 20 year old sister. How are you going to kill your baby sister just for flirting with your so-called boyfriend online? Yes, and not over Facebook, over a damn video game. The video game called Valorant. And some of y'all might be looking around like Valorant. I thought it was going to be Street Fighter or Mortal Kombat or Tekken or Tecmo Bowl. No, no. Uh, Valorant is a five verse five first person shooter it's like a tactical rpg for those who know anything about video games now on this game valorant marzan yes father ha to be exact been playing this game quite a few years her and her long distant boyfriend and my thing is this did she ever see the boyfriend like what is the boyfriend name we just go by rafi or muhammad or ali It's out of one of them three right there now anyway back to the story now father ha and her unidentified boyfriend been playing Valorant for some years now. And also, father had to see sister Sama Marzan, the one that was killed. Now, this is things take a turn left. Instead of them just playing video games and getting offline or whatnot. And my thing is this, like, uh, you're 21, but you've been grown for a few years. Why are y'all still playing video games just to communicate? I mean, damn, don't you have each other phone number? That's what I'm trying to say right there. So anyway, lo and behold... Just like some women do, and men too also, they want what you have. So I guess Sama looking over there, looking at Father Ha, enjoying her video game sessions, playing and laughing. And Sama wanted the same thing. But guess what? You got to go get it yourself. You can't come take mine. So Father Ha seen that her sister, Sama, and her boyfriend that she was playing video games with online were texting and flirting with each other. And that's when Father Ha, yes, went right to Amazon.com and all the a sharp dagger said, notice, she didn't go to Dollar Tree, she didn't go to Family Dollar, she didn't go to Fred's, no, she went right to the source to get the great Ginsu knives, for those who know about those sharp knives. So, upon her getting her order in, she basically plotted this whole murder out, took her sister life, yes, early in the wee wee morning hours, around 4.30 to 6.30, says the police source. Anyway, we'll break the rest down as I read a snippet from this story. I'm going to read a snippet from this story, and I am going to get my opinion, all of it. <clears throat> Surely, as we go, Florida woman accused of stabbing sister to death for flirting with her boyfriend online. She is not only accused, she actually admitted to the stabbing, so no more damn accusations, none of that. Because as you all know, one thing about the Trey King show, we do not speculate. We speak number of fat, fat facts over here all day, every day, like my people in St. Louis say. Now, anyway, an Orlando woman is being charged with first degree murder and allegedly, ain't no damn allegedly, she admitted it, stabbing her younger sister to death. 
damn, how are you going to stab your younger sister to death just because you playing video games with her and you got feelings for somebody online? And my thing is this, Father, huh? did you ever, I know y'all don't call it wood, uh, y'all don't call it penis, did you ever, uh, did y'all ever become intimate? That's what I want to know right there because for you to go left like this, evidently you have strong feelings for this man online. And I don't know what Rafi, Muhammad, Ali, I don't know what he said to you during those video game sessions, but evidently he must have told you that he was going to do something strange for a little piece of change. Anyway, now Father Hard Morrison, the star of the hour, 21 years old, looking at her, bitch, I don't give a damn about taking my sister life. You mess with my diggling, that's your ass, Mr. Postman, 31 in the face. Has confessed to stabbing her sibling, Sabah Morzan, in the heart multiple times after discovering that the sister had been messaging and flirting with her unidentified long distance boyfriend of five years through Valorant, through the damn video game. It's not like she was on her phone or anything like that. And how in the hell did you pull the messages up to even check? I mean, how did you get to the archives? That's why I want to know right there because if that's the case, I needed to go delete some of my messages on, uh, NBA 2K and stuff like that because you ain't gonna get me caught up anyway. But how do people and why do people get so mad over people they meet online? I don't understand it because I had that problem also. I ain't gonna call no names out because I don't want to uh, rough no feathers or whatnot or you know things like that. But I'm gonna say this right here: How do you get mad over somebody just because uh, they talk to somebody else and you never met this person? And you see this person online? I mean, damn, is it that serious? Now, imagine if you was to meet that person in person, if you already this crazy over this person just because of what you see over the internet. But anyway, some people be just like that. Let's continue with the story. Now, two weeks before the premeditated attack, Marzon had purchased a dagger-style knife set from Amazon, hiding the knives in a backpack, stole, yes, stole away in the back of her closet. How are you going to sit there and just playing all this on your sister like that, and your sister over there just walking around like it's all good? Golly, I'm not trying to be funny, but Lord... Give us a sign. You know what I'm saying? I guess all kinds of signs. You know what I'm saying? If the back of my damn uh head store hurting or whatever, if I'm around somebody, I'm getting the hell away because you just may try some, or I may just try some. Before I know it, I'll reach over there and pop you like, damn, did I do that? Anyway, let's finish up. I say my more son reportedly turned herself in, initially confessing to the grisly crime while calling 911 to report her sister's body. 15 hours after she stabbed her sister three times, three to four times, they say, in the heart. So it goes to show you that she meant to kill her sister over somebody that she was playing video games with online over somebody that she had feelings for. That don't make no damn sense. I mean, have you not heard that blood is thicker than water? I mean, how would you get so mad and why would you get so mad at your sister? Why not get mad at the guy? Why not cut the communication off with him? Why not stop playing video games with him? Now, true enough, some of y'all might be saying, well, Trey, she may go back and try to, uh, do that again to her sister, somebody that's closer to her, somebody that's not so long distance. But at the same time, you got to understand this. That's your family. You know what I'm saying? You get all kinds of people coming in and out your life. You can choose them, but guess what? You can't choose your family. Now, true enough, her sister should have been more respectful, but it's never get that serious. It should never, ever, 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 ever get that damn serious. Well, you're going to take a family member life just because of them flirting with uh somebody that really you don't even know it's not even like this, your husband and wife. And even then... If my husband or my wife was flirting back, guess what? I would divorce them, probably put the paws on my family member, but I wouldn't kill them. Hell no, live and let live, because guess what? You lose one, you win 10 more. There's always more fish in the sea, but guess what? It's going to be hard to get fish <laughs> when you're in prison. You get what I'm saying? So, all this could have been easily avoided. I don't understand. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to be online playing video games, having fun. You know what I'm saying? But I always tell you about these people with these squirrel faces. These are some bad people. Y'all better be aware. But anyway, let this be a lesson to you all. Keep it real, always. You can get caught up doing all kinds of stuff. You can get caught up on Facebook. You can get caught up on Twitter. And evidently, you get caught up through Valorant playing games online. But at the same time, if you know that your family member is communicating with somebody or if they have feelings for a person, you know, you should respect them enough to back away and let them be. And if that person still want to be with you or mess with you, don't do it behind your family member back. Tell them the man or woman up and tell the person that want to be with them. And then if you're crazy enough to go be with the person, because one thing about it, I don't want no damn draws. Uh, one of my family members don't have. You can keep that cookie. You can keep them draws. Because guess what? I found something else. But it's a right and a wrong way. No, not to love somebody. Y'all about to say that. No, it's a right and a wrong way to do things. But anyway, you all let me know what you think about this story. If that's anything I may have missed or misinformed, which is not my true intent, Please let me know in the comment section or you can email me. We can talk about it more there. If you like the video, push that like button. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel. Become a channel member. 
Also, share the video with your family and friends. Until next time, you all stay blessed. And I will see you all soon on the next Trey King Show. And guess what? I'm out.